as per ICAO and FAA guidelines for airports, various visual and non-visual aids, which are located near runways, taxiways and aprons, may present a hazard to aircraft in the event of accidental impact during landing, takeoff or ground maneuvering. All such equipments and their supports should be frangible and mounted as low as possible to ensure that impact does not result in loss of control of the aircraft. The space on and near runway is defined in three zones. Zone 1 is the flying area and needs to be obstruction free. Zone 2 is the runway equipment area. Equipments and its supports located in Zone 2 should be frangible in order to ensure that they will break, distort or yield in the event that an aircraft accidentally impacts them. Zone 3 is the no restriction area. SGS is a manufacturer of frangible towers, mast, poles for hoisting weather equipments, approach lights, ILS, wind mast, etc. for airports and helipads. Both lattice and pole type frangible structures are manufactured for various aviation applications. Evo's lattice tower AT5010 and approach light pole LP4010 were successfully crash tested for frangibility test strictly in compliance with IKO guidelines, aerodrome design material and US Department of Transportation FAA advisory circular. The test was witnessed and authenticated by the following experts. Necessary safety measures were considered at site. The aircraft wing was stimulated by creating an impactor of similar shape mounted on the vehicle.